The French government has banned students from wearing abayas to public schools because according to the education minister, you shouldn't be able to identify people's religion just by looking at them. It's been met with a lot of backlash, especially from the people at the heart of this, Muslim schoolgirls. Here's how they've pushed back. First off, what's an abaya? Basically, it's a loose long sleeve garment, although it's worn by some Muslim women and girls, some inherently religious which has raised a lot of questions about how the law will be enforced. In one instance, a 15-year-old student was sent home pulling a kimono to school and is now filing a discrimination complaint. On the first day of school, nearly 300 Muslim schoolgirls showed up in abayas and about 70 girls who refused to remove them were sent home. And in a suburb northeast of Paris, students and teachers went on strike in protest of the ban. French Muslims and advocates have called the abaya ban Islamophobic and said it's just another and a slew of laws targeting France's 5 million Muslims. The law was passed as part of France's secularism policies, which promotes a strict separation of church and state. In 2004, there was a ban on religious expression in public schools, which included hijab. Similar restrictions include the 2011 ban on the in public and bans on bikinis and public pools and beaches in France.